Hi friends, it's Mrs. Bassett. So I thought we'd start out with a real quick review on slope and um, also solving for y and then how to transfer it in to a graph. So here we go. So I'm gonna start out with something really simple. So three x plus y equals six, okay? All right, so we know that we want to get y all by itself when we're in slope intercept form. So right away, I'm gonna look at this. Is this three x positive or negative? So let's look, oh, this is positive. So I'm going to subtract three x. Oh, because remember at the top, let's write down our slope intercept form. Y equals n x plus e, okay? So I'm gonna minus three x. Now I can't, subtract six and three X. But I'm gonna put it so that the X is first with the negative, it's a negative three X, sad face, such a pessimist, right? Plus six. So here is my equation, okay? So there's my equation. So now let's pick apart what these pieces are. So, negative three. Now remember that slope is always rise over run. So I'm going to put a one underneath. So that's, this is my, let me move it down here. This is my slope. Okay. And then this piece here is my y intercept. Now between the two, which one do we graph first? Right. We're going to graph the y intercept. So here we go. We're gonna graph a dot at the y-intercept of six. Ha ha, so we'll turn it over. So here we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, and put a dot up here. Now, what was the slope? Let's look back. Well, the slope was a negative three. Hmm, so rise over run. Rise means to go up or down, and run means to go left and right. So I'm going to go from my y-intercept, I'm gonna go one, two, three, and always go to the right. And then connect the two lines. Ta-da, there you go. Okay, all right, your turn now. You ready? Okay. Ooh. Not so good of a whiteboard. Here we go. So I'm going to give you a little bit harder one. Um, I'm going to do 2y, negative 2y. Um, plus x equals 4. Okay. So what I want you to do right now is I want you to stop the video um, and I want to see if you can get this problem, okay? And so I'm going to give you a series of questions at the end to see if you can get this correct, okay? All right, thanks friends, bye. Don't forget to graph it too.